click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in the previous lecture we have gotten about what is Hello Arrange as well as we have also discussed about the classification of Hello Arrange. And also we have discussed about the some of the uh, IPC nomenclature of the dihalogen derivatives of Arrange as well as the polyhalogen derivatives of uh, Arrange. And now this is a separate topic that uh, where we are going to talk about the IPC nomenclature of the structural formula of Hello Arrange. So how can we give the name to them? So let us talk about it. So talking about the first example that is so this is what we have and uh, we have to give the IPC nomenclature to this structure and this is basically we could call it as this that is hello arenes and um, talking about uh, the preference because here the two groups that we could see that is one is methyl group and one is chloro group that has been attached to the benzene so we have to give preference to which of the group even that is very much important. So that is the reason that uh, so we have understood in basically the IUPAC nomenclature of uh, the alkanes also as well as in this case we are going to uh, prefer that uh, point only where this is the halogen atom that has been attached to the aromatic ring and uh, or that has been attached to the hydrocarbon and all the carbon atoms have been uh, attached uh, uh, continuous to each other. So this is the carbon number one that I could give it and this is the carbon number two that I should give in that way. So the name of this one could be given as because uh, uh, on the second position where we could find a methyl group but on the first position we get uh, a chloro group. So according to the IPC the name should be given in such a manner that uh, it should be of alphabetical order. So that is the reason that we could give the name or the IPC name to this structure as 1 chloro, 2 methyl and overall it is a benzene. So this is how we uh, can give the IPC nomenclature to the structure that we have over here. And now let us move to the next one that is. So again this is the another structure that uh, we, have, uh, we have mentioned over here and uh, talking about the next one that is uh, now here yeah, the halogen that, uh, that has been present over here is basically it is an example of or under the classification of that is dihaloarene. But uh, in the previous one or in the previous lecture we have got to know about uh, that is uh, we have taken the example where the two similar halogen atoms that will be attached on uh, the aromatic ring that is benzene. But talking about this thing that is there are two different uh, halogen atoms that are being attached over here. One is bromine atom and one is chlorine atom. So now the preference should be given to what? Yes, again we should prefer that is the alphabetical order uh, according to the IPC nomenclature. So therefore we could give the uh, number in, in this way where this carbon gets uh, the carbon number 1, this is carbon number 2 and this is carbon number 3. So now talking about the IPC nomenclature, again it should be uh, alphabetical and that's the reason that uh, the IPC name for this structure can be given as 1-bromo, 3-chloro, and uh, overall the parent hydrocarbon in this case is basically benzene so therefore we could give it the parent name as benzene so this is what we have and uh, so this is the different kind that we have studied over here and now let us move on to the next one or the next feature that we have is so this is the structure that we have but uh, as we have mentioned earlier also that is uh, the halogen derivatives of arenes are those in which one hydrogen or more than one hydrogen are atom are be replaced by the corresponding number of the halogen atoms. In this case, basically, this is uh, the aromatic ring that we have, but this is the methyl group or this is the methyl group that we have, and on that, basically, a halogen atom has been attached on this thing. So, basically, uh, the uh, uh, halogen derivatives of arenes are basically divided into two sections that is, the one where the halogen atoms that could uh, directly attached on the carbon atom and uh, and the other one is basically this is an example of that one where uh, this kind of uh, uh, compound are basically known as side chain substituted uh, that is halorine and this is what we have over here and uh, but talking about the uh, IPC nomenclature the IPC nomenclature will follow the rule of uh, the IPC nomenclature of alkane in this case basically the bromine has been attached on uh, the methylene group that is been present over here so therefore this carbon would be given as carbon number one and that's the reason that on carbon number one bromine has been attached as well as the phenyl group is also been attached over here so therefore we could give the name as one bromo one phenyl 
methane. So this is what we have. And now let us move on to the next one that is. So this is what we have and uh, let us talk about this one that is uh, here basically again it is an example of an uh, halorene. So the numbering should be given to or the least number should be given to the carbon atom where the bromine or where the halogen atom is been attached and in this case I could give the number as this is carbon number one. I would move in a clockwise direction so because here the number of substitute I could get more so therefore this is carbon number two, three and four. So the group that I have been attached in this aromatic ring or in this benzene is basically bromine, bromine atom or bromo, bromo group, methyl group as well as one is basically isopropyl group. So according to the alphabetical order also we could prefer the name as 1-bromo, 2-methyl and on the fourth position there is 4-isopropyl. Four and overall the parent hydrocarbon is in this case is benzene so this is what we have and that's it this is a few examples that i have mentioned in this lecture so that's it so thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood this video very clearly and you have got to know that how can we give the IPC nomenclature to the structure of the hello anemes and that's it so i hope you'll join me next time and i hope you'll share this video with your friends and yes don't forget to subscribe thank you so much